What's going on YouTube? Landon Huppin here back with another video and we are down here in Concord, North Carolina to start our day today picking up a 10 foot trailer for merchandise. So I'm going to take you guys with me. We actually already picked it up. I'll show you once we've got to stop up here, make sure all the lights are working. And I'm going to explain a little bit about what we've got in store for our merchandise in 2024. We're going to be taking a trailer to every racetrack hopefully up in our merchandise game and improving our website and all that good stuff. But we're also gonna head back to the race shop and work on our cars tour late model tonight. We're hanging the body, so I'm gonna give you guys an update and uh, kind of walk you through everything that we're doing this evening. It's just gonna be a day vlog, a shop vlog, and uh, just another inside look at what we're doing here at Hoping Races. So thank you guys for being here and clicking on today's video. I really appreciate it. Channel's doing well, and we're gonna keep preparing for the upcoming season. So I'm gonna take you guys along for the ride. There's the old unit. I did drive my Chevy today, but uh, I had to stop here at the bank, and uh, that's what she looks like. It's a 10 footer. Hell, I might build a rack on top. I don't know. We'll see. All right, done at the bank and uh, headed back to the old Huffman Racing headquarters. <laughs> Hello, Rich. Hello. How we doing? I'm doing good. What are we doing? I'm cutting the quarter windows out. So we can put the roof on, right? Yep. Okay, we'll have a brawl. You don't want a fine job. Hello, Gut. Hello, Landon. What are we doing? Well, I decided to get this drive shaft out from under the car and put the grease caps on that you said you were going to do for me last night. I didn't do it. You didn't do it. <laughs> so I'm, I'm going to do that right quick. Okay. <laughs> the motor is out of Gilbert, uh, for those of you that are blind. And then uh, Deuce no longer has a body because we are stripping it and going over some stuff so that we can hang new body parts on it. So as you can see, it is, well, I guess you can't see, but it's dark now. And um, I didn't get a chance to show you guys the inside of the merchandise trailer because I got caught up on some phone calls and a whole bunch of other stuff. But I will show you that in another video. It's just, there's nothing inside it. It's a 10 foot trailer, but we are taking that trailer to every single race that I will be racing this year, uh, both to the Cars Tour and on the weekly side of things, we will have a uh, merchandise trailer everywhere. So not only will you be able to shop online, uh, but we'll have an adequate, supply of merchandise at every track uh, with a bunch of different designs for all of my cars not just the cars tour or the weekly car or whatever we might be racing that night but um, also the modified and things of that nature so the first place we will have it at is new Smyrna for speed weeks um, in february this car was also not in the shop last video we made but this is a uh this is jimmy mooring's second car that he owns which jeremy mayfield drove last year it's a 2017 hedgecock car we're using it for some parts and then i think we're going to try to sell this thing the nose is beat up on it but uh, this car set on the outside pole at martinsville in 2019 and if you're interested in a good limited or a charger car we will have this available uh, for sale we also picked up this pit box of jimmy Morris, which we're going to be using on the cars tour so it needs a little TLC, but we got a full selection of gears and uh, all kinds of good stuff that we will be using um, come March in the tour. And then many of you have been asking about the modified. It's back here. We have our uh, air jacks and stuff ready to rock and roll. We're actually going to go test this thing at Caraway um, here in the, in the next week or two before we go to New Smyrna. The reason we've kind of been in a holding period on the modified is because we don't have a seat. So I had to custom order a seat from uh, the Joy of Seating, which is Randy LaJoy and Corey LaJoy's seat business, which I use in all of my cars. I like their seats a lot and uh, haven't ever given me any trouble. And Moonhead crashed in one of their seats earlier this year and it held up like a charm. So if that tells you anything, uh, I, would, uh, I would check them out. Um, but yeah, the modified doesn't have a seat. So that's what we're waiting on. As soon as we get the seat in it, we can go to set up and go test and get ready for New Smyrna. What are we doing, Dad? Trying to hang a body. You guys have seen these new body parts, but we are finally on the ground and going to begin the body hanging process, which if you've been watching my channel for a while, you've seen us do this several times <coughs> on a couple of different race cars, but uh, this will be the first RNS car that we've ever hung a body on. Are 
we've got the greenhouse riveted together so it's about to go on we're probably going to stack it up and go ahead and put our quarters on that way we can set it all on and get our forward and aft correct ain't that right rich that's right over here in huffman racing south our left front fender was tore off of it after the last time we raced it so we took deuce's fender off we just put it on gilbert and then this car is probably going to be our show car for daytona when we go down to new smyrna because we do have to be down there again for high rock um, at the total wine and more right there in daytona beach so this will be wrapped high rock and it'll be our show car while we're down there and if you put two and two together based off of that last statement then you will most likely be able to figure out what big sponsor announcement we have coming out in the very near future so it doesn't take an uh a scientist, an architect, or a uh, paleontologist to figure that out. So if you do your math right, you probably know what's coming on that front. Are you sawing on something good? Yeah. What'd you just come over here and get? What are you chiseling? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't think we talked about this in our last uh, video, but we do have both of our engines out. We have three engines here at Huffman Racing, but we have our enforcer and our crate motor out of our car. So they will be going to uh, Clark's Automotive with Rayvon Clark. He's going to be our engine builder here at Huffman Racing uh, going into next year. And then David West is going to build our car for the car or our motor for the cars tour with uh, Jimmy Mooring. But we got these out, got them ready to go to Rayvon. Now that I got the body off of Deuce, uh, it needs a lot of TLC. I started taking this stuff apart yesterday. Got the leg braces out of it. I'm gonna get the seat out <clears throat> and just try to go over everything since we never really had the opportunity to do so. Once we got it uh, last year, we kind of just rushed a body on it and took it racing. So now that we have it apart, we'll be able to uh, look over everything and fix what needs to be fixed. Y'all will, uh, will like this. So we're having a bunch of body parts, obviously, that were taken off. This was the fender off of Gilbert, that big chunk taken out of it. That's going to go to uh, Jordan Powell because he took a lot of pictures for me this year. It's got his logo on it, so I'm going to sign that, send it to him. And then this baby right here was off of Deuce. Had to put my John Hancock on it, and it's going to Mr. Dell Jr. So uh, Mr. High Rock Vodka himself requested the door. So that's where it's going. Maybe it'll be up in the... Uh, DJD Bojangles Studio, who knows? So this is gonna be 34 and a half. What are we doing here? It's amazing when you take and put three more bolts into a chair, how much better it sits. That thing's been broke for about 12 years. No, it wasn't broke, it's just the damn bolts were out of it. Oh, test it out, let's see it. Yeah, okay, now we're gonna see it. Put your money where your mouth's at. Man, look at look that. At that. I ain't bust my ass yet. Brand hammer new, gut. Way well, to go. How much you how much you would give me for it now? None. Oh, also, he put lock boxes on my thermostat because I just had a twenty four hundred dollar power bill, or not a power bill, a propane bill. So now we have a lock box and I turned that baby all the way down. I think you did too. This is a quarter panel we took off of Gilbert. Somehow that thing made it all year. But uh the, most of that damage come from the car store race, but thank you to Central Carolina Scale for supporting us at Tri-County the last race, and then when we went to uh, Wake County, I'm going to have to get this to them because I'm sure he'll he'll enjoy that or put it up somewhere. But now we got Gilbert uh, Fender Off Deuce on here. Just got to fasten it down, and then uh, got to get another quarter panel out of my used stash from Carol Speed Shop to stick on. Everything that you carry around because you lose every damn thing. Thank you for your help, Gut. You're welcome, anytime. All right. Hey, everybody, Astro's going to Florida, just to let you guys know. Oh, no, he's not. Yep. <laughs> he is our car chief for the weekend. Ain't that right, Rich? Uh, exactly right. Yeah. A lot of five experts. Yeah. So I think I'll be there to help new tires, so we're going to have to have some able bodies. Yeah, and Clay's our new intern. You're going to have to do some It's not, it is not paid, just to let you know. It actually costs you money to intern here. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It costs money. Everybody's fully invested at Huffman Racing. <laughs> yeah. Some way or another. Yeah. Do you have a significant other, Clay? No. All right, and you're pretty and you're in good shape then. I got this thing pretty much ready to come out, so I'll mess with that tomorrow. And then 
How far did we get in there, Rich? Got it ready to put the quarter panels on it? Yes, that's the greenhouse located roughly. How many you put quarters on it? All right, that's the plan. So, got the greenhouse located. Quarters will go on it tomorrow. And then, uh, keep, keep, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> <laughs> then we can continue mounting from there. <laughs> oh my God, I can go eat dinner, Rich. All righty, thank you guys for tuning in to another shop vlog video whatever um i'll show you the more plans on the merchandise stuff as we get closer to time but uh we're making steady progress it's slow but it's steady got a lot of stuff going on here at huffing racing it's crazy to see the difference between now and uh one year ago ain't that right rich yeah big difference a lot of race cars and no help yeah we got more cars than we have people in room yep but uh we're getting there shop looks a lot better and uh I guess I'll see you guys in the next shop video. I don't know when it'll be, but we'll keep you updated what's going on. Thanks again for watching. And if you haven't already, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out.